today's video is going to be DIY color changing pencils. This video was seriously so much fun to find ingredients and create it and make it and finally give it to you guys. I've been working on this for about over a month now. Supplies for getting it was rough. Filming it was rough, finding time to do everything was rough, but I finally have it here and I'm so excited and kind of was doubtful that they were going to work, but they're actually awesome. And I'm gonna have more color changing things in the future because I have a lot of supplies left over and I really wanna push myself to be creative with this. So if you guys wanna see DIY color changing pencils, then just keep watching. So first you're going to need some pencils. I chose UB because they're already colored, therefore it makes it a lot easier to paint on anything on it. Plus the white erasers look super cool and these are found at Target. And next you're going to need some ultra thermal dust from solardust.com. I found these through Haley Williams. It's a really cool website. Also some Elmer's clear glue, some paint relative to your colors, and also meet my new cat, Penny. Next you're going to need a clean bowl and a color of solar dust that matches your color pencil. I chose purple to blue to match my purple pencil. This stuff is so cool and super fine. It comes with these little pink shovels. So I took about half a shovel into my bowl. You just need to unscrew the cap, kind of like a loose eyeshadow, and then I dumped that in. And next, moving on, I added some clear glue. I didn't use any measurements. I just kind of added it and eyed it. So cool because the glue and the powder actually kind of separate from each other and don't mix and the glue kind of balls up around the powder which really looked awesome but once you work at it with the shovel they start to mix and don't worry if the bottom of your bowl turns blue it's just the color changing because of the heat. Once you mix it it'll turn into this nice smooth mixture and I added pink and blue paint because I didn't have any purple to make a lighter lilac shade because I really wanted a lighter purple instead of the dark purple that it had. Adding paint will alter the effect of it because it will change the color turning part of it, making it lighter. But once you add the paint, just begin painting it onto your paintbrush, making sure to get all around it, including the eraser. If you get it on the wood part, do not worry because that can be always sharpened off. I actually stuck these in my cat's scratching post because it allows them to dry without touching anything. If you can find a different way to do this, then feel free. To then basically just repeat this process over and over again with any other solar dust that you have. I got a pack of five, which of a mini tester ones, which turned out to be about $30. So basically just take the according color matching to the solar dust and repeat this process over and over again until you have as many pencils as you want. Then let the pencils dry overnight to make sure nothing is tacky and the changing color part really shines when you put them in hot water. It kind of changes instantly like when you put Barbie's hair if you were in the bath as a kid and it changed colors when you touched water and it was really cool. Also the color part really shines when you are writing something with the pencil obviously because that's what you do with the pencil. But the heat of your hand and the friction of writing causes the pencil to change colors. Within seconds the pencils change back to their original color and it's really cool to watch this color change as it kind of see Keeps up the pencil and slowly gradients to the original color. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it. Leave a comment, thumbs up, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next week with a brand new video. Love you guys so much. Bye. Mwah.